everyone, Pretzel here, and I'm just like the professor, and today we are making a wig. Okay, so today we are making the professor's laboratory in the Powerpuff Girls house. So if you saw my other video, we made the house, and the one room that we left unfinished was the professor's laboratory so that's what i've been working on and i'm about to show you guys the last part of finishing it so as you can see there are a ton of decals on the walls if you look over here this is one two three one two three four five six seven eight there are eight pictures over here and then there are eight pictures over here and then there are eight pictures over here and then six right here so I basically had to take like a really large image and break it up into a lot of smaller pieces and then place them on the wall. It took me a few hours to do, but if you guys don't want to have to worry about doing that, just go to my uh, Roblox profile. It's pretzel underscore etzel. Go to my inventory and then you'll see all the decals that I used. And they're already split up so you don't have to worry about that. So yes, this is what we're starting with with the laboratory for the Powerpuff Girls' father, Professor. And as you can see, the floor is already like a metal. I put the lights in and now we're just going to finish decorating the rest of it. And uh, yeah, I'm going to show you guys how I do that. So let's just go into build mode and let's get started. Okay, so let's get on over there. I don't even know if this will be like an actual speed build because I really only have to put some furniture in there to finish it. But I would also like to just zoom in and show you guys. See, look, I'm going to just color everything. So one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. This is for one image. And then one, one, two, three, four. Yep. And then eight over here. And then this picture that I made only needed one, two, three, four, five, six pictures. So yeah, eight, eight, and eight. And then this one right here, I think I need to just adjust it just a little bit. Hold on. Let's make a really small grid and let's just, there we go. Okay, it was a little messed up, but now it's fixed. So let's get to decorating the room. I already know what I wanna do. So let's remove the roof right here and let's start with the let's start with the desk over there. So this desk right here we will color it in after everything is said and done. Let's change the grid size to super large and let's just rotate it until it's on the wall and it's probably backwards right now. I'm not really sure yet. I usually don't find out until the end. And then we also need a laptop and we need some other decorations for the desk so let's go with paper and there we go and then let's also do like um, let's do the pins the cup that has all the pins inside of them there we go we actually need that one to be more over there on the corner so let's just move it like this okay now we're just gonna quickly color this two tables. I'm going to need to put this one right here. There we go. And then let's also start working on this little chemical shelf that I'm going to make over here. So in order to make that, I'm going to have to use like seasoning. So let's go to all and then let's type in spice. Yep. Okay. So it's right here, it's actually the spice rack. We're gonna put a lot of these right here. I 
Is this supposed to be the la the the lab's chemicals, you know, the ones that the professor uses, Professor Utonium. So let's color these. Let's try to give it like an orange color, like the things on the wall. So hold on, blah, 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 blah. We're looking for the perfect orange. You know what? Let's just try to uh, make it the same color as this over here. It will probably save us a lot of time. There we go. That's actually a really good color. Okay, now let's just color the tops like a light green color. Okay, so all the lab chemicals are colored and we just need to also put his bed in. So let's go and let's pick a bed. Let's go with... Oh wait, there's one more thing we actually forgot to do too. We forgot to put a, a, a desk chair, like an office chair. So let's go to decorate. Let's go to chairs and let's go with this one right here. And let's color it. Let's make it kind of gray. There we go. Alrighty. Now let's decorate and let's put... Um, let's put his bed and we might need to recolor those shelves but uh let's go with this one and we're actually going to rotate it so let's put the really big grid on and there we go now let's put the small grid so that we can move it closer to the wall so that it's not in such a weird place Okay, there we go for that. It's looking good so far. Let's let's zoom in and let's color the bed. No, 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 no. That looks so uncomfortable. You cannot sleep on a bed that's made of metal, but the, the base can be made of the metal. So let's just make the base that color. The pillow can stay that weird grayish color, but the top one right here like the top sheet needs to be changed is there a lighter orange color Okay, here we go so now we have some radioactive bins they look they actually look really really scary now let's go over here and let's rotate this table and let's see if we can put something on no 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 and let's see if we can put something on here so <laughs> okay let's move this table right here now let's see if we can put something that looks like chemicals that a lab would have so let's go ahead and let's do Let's try to put the soap. Yep, okay, so the soap can definitely go on there. Let's see, what else can we put on there that a lab would have? Uh, the soap is actually supposed to look like chemicals, guys. So once I'm finished placing it, then I will put the color. So just give me a moment, please. Because I know right now it doesn't look too scary or too serious. Okay. Mm, what else do we have here? Okay, now we're going to need some kind of mixing bowl because, you know, we pretty much have to make do with what we have, so we don't have any beakers or anything, so it was called a pestle, I think is what they call it. Yep, here we go. Da -da, let's put that right here, and then let's put some more... No, not no more of those. Okay, you know what? I think it's good enough for now. So let's just color it. Let's give it some really creepy colors. Okay. 
Okay, and as far as the inside of the bottle, it needs to be something really neon green, kind of scary looking. And then the outside should actually be white so that the color shows up. So we're just going to go with that. Here we go. We're going to paint that one this color. We change the green to really bright yellow. There we go. Let's also get this one down here. Da -da -da -da. Let's do... Let's go with pink. There we go. The lava lamp looks more intense like this. Okay, guys. So the lab is almost finished. We now just have to add the rugs that he's going to need. So let's go ahead and type in... Oh, I actually think you call them carpets here, so we'll see it. Yep, here we go. We're going to go with these carpets, and we want one underneath his desk area. Let's go ahead and hop on a scooter so we can get down there. By the way, those balloons are there because I was actually going to have a dinner party in the sky here in Unicorn City, but then I decided, I was like, you know what, just buy another plot here and just make the party there so that you don't have to ruin the city. So here we are, everyone. Welcome to the professor's lab, the Powerpuff Girls lab. If you haven't seen my other video of the house, this is the Powerpuff Girls house, obviously, and this is their room. Their room is already finished. But the professor didn't have a room, so he literally had no place to sleep, so I, I had him sitting over on the couch. But now he has his own place. So, here we go. This is him typing on his desk. This is where he's going to sleep. If he wants to do his, his, like, experiments or whatever, you know, he can go on over here and mess with that stuff and it's actually really really big he should stay away from this because this is this is a very radioactive chemical that is very very dangerous okay guys so that is it for the tour and for i guess the build tutorial thank you so much for watching click to watch more videos and subscribe